Hey there lovely people and welcome to my channel. I'm Anna and today I'm so excited to show you how to supercharge your bookkeeping game with our easy bookkeeping template. So grab your favorite cup of coffee, settle in and let's dive into the world of organized finances with our easy bookkeeping template. First, let's select the currency you want to see on the template. We've got plenty of options available and if you need a specific currency that isn't listed, don't hesitate to contact us. Then choose your 12 month starting point by picking the start month and year. You can either choose the first month of the year, no matter today's month, or go with the current month and start working from here. Next, we have the payment methods. You can configure up to 12 payment methods, whether you're paying or getting paid. Now let's focus on the essentials. In the section, you can set up to 20 categories for both income and expenses. After that, let's jump to the set your monthly profit goals section, where you can enter your desired goal amount for each month. And that's it for the setup page. Let's make some entries now on the income and expense entry tabs. ID is an optional entry where you can submit any relevant transaction ID if needed. To add the date to your transaction, simply type it in the cell. On Google Sheets, you can double click the cell and the pop-up window will appear allowing you to choose the date directly from the calendar. Next, we have the category, a column that offers you a drop-down list of all the categories you've set up on the setup page. The description is an optional column where you can write any relevant details about the transaction. Now let's talk about the total amount and tax columns. The total amount should reflect the amount including any applicable taxes. To simplify things, we've added a most common tax rate section on the upper right corner of both the income entry and expense entry tabs. Here you can set the default tax rate that will be automatically applied to transactions if the tax rate column remains empty. However, you can always override this default by setting a specific tax rate for individual transactions. The net and tax amount column are calculated automatically based on the total amount and tax rate you've entered. In the paid with column, you can select the payment method used for the transaction. Lastly, we have the notes, also an optional column. Well, there you have it. Let's move now to the balance tab, where the income total and expense total columns display the sum of all income and expense transactions associated with each payment method. It automatically calculates the balance for each payment method by subtracting the total expenses from the total income. Alright, let's move into the main tabs now. The monthly tab is your window into the detailed breakdown of your finances month by month. To access the information for a specific month, simply select the desired month from the drop-down menu. Please note that the months available in the drop-down are based on the 12-month starting point you set on the setup page. If you need to view months outside this range, you can modify the starting point on the setup page and then choose the desired month. Next. Choose the amount type you want to view. You have three options, tax amount, net amount and total amount. This selection will determine the values displayed in the boards below. And the two boards below will automatically display the information you've selected. Now we've done with the monthly tab and we can move to the annual tab which is coming with two main boards. These boards showcase a breakdown of your income and expenses for each of the 12 months. You can customize the amounts displayed using the drop-down menus, choosing between total, net or tax options. 
On the right side of the boards, you'll find the annual total for each category over 12 month period. But that's not all. Further below, we have the cash flow month by month section displaying essential financial data for each month of the year and a smaller board showing the year to date profit and year's goal progress. Lastly, we have a section where you can submit your sales tax amounts. Enter the sales tax you collect and the sales tax you paid for each month. The template will automatically calculate the difference, simplifying your tax tracking process. And that's all. From now on, you can call yourself a bookkeeping wiz. If you have any other questions or need further assistance with the bookkeeping template, feel free to reach out using the contact information provided in the description box below or directly through it. Thank you for joining me today and I hope this video has given you the clarity and confidence to take control of your finances effortlessly. Remember, knowledge is power and with our template you've just unlocked a world of financial possibilities. Stay organized, stay informed and most importantly, stay awesome. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more useful content. Until next time, have a fantastic day!